I'm Louis Kellen. And I'm Megan Kellen. We live in Grand Rapids, Minnesota. We are entrepreneurs and we have three children. Finley's seven, Oli is five, and our little monster is just about two. We both grew up here in Grand Rapids, but we spent quite a few years traveling in between. We spent about a decade out in Colorado. So I was in corporate America. Megan was working in publishing. We started our family out in Colorado, had a great lifestyle, great friends. Loved everything about where we were living. We moved back here for family reasons. My mom was sick and we wanted to be back here for support. I moved my media company, B Media House, from Colorado to Minnesota. I was still able to operate a nationwide media company from a rural area. That's where the conversation began with Cohouse Collective, a co-working space. I had two co-working spaces in Colorado. I knew the power of community and having resources at your fingertips. And I really wanted to bring that back to our hometown. Grand Rapids has got young families, good schools, great health care, and we're a stone's throw away from some of the best natural environment and recreational opportunities in arguably the entire country. Our first big project right when we moved back to town was rehabilitating a budget host motel and we gutted it from the inside out and now it's a boutique style 30 room hotel with a crepe craft cocktail bistro. We do live music. It's just a really unique space. It was the hotel that really inspired me to start Lake Time Magazine. It was our guests that were coming in and telling us their stories that kind of blew us away. We're seeing people from all over the world come in and check into Grand Rapids. So we started asking some questions. We're in a, a unique place in the world where there's a lot of very creative, very talented people. And I think a lot of that's attributed to the long winters and the harsh environmental conditions that we experience. It just, it forces you to kind of go to different places internally. And so there's not really much of a platform for the, the stories to be told, and that's where Lake Time fills that gap. About six months after starting Lake Time Magazine, we started Lake Bride Magazine. And about six months after that, we started a store called the Lake and Company Shop. Our stories come from all over the place, but really this is uh, where our main sense of inspiration and drive come from. One of the coolest parts of coming back to this community and, you know, going on this entrepreneur journey is being able to share it with our parents and, and have, you know, them be a part of, of whatever we're creating and having their support through it. Whether it's for the store or B Media House or one of our magazines or even one of our properties, all of the brands and people that we work with have a deep and wild story. It's these stories that we focus on telling and we always find ways to promote and lift each other up. There are a mix of choices between city life and wildlife, community and solitude, structure and freedom. The greatest opportunity is to be able to access those choices and to find balance in them. Mm -hmm.